so you probably don't care about actually how to get your CDL. Um, basically, the first thing you're going to do is just go take the permit test, which literally Quizlet. Uh, it's like I think the permit test you get like. There's three parts. Each part has 20 questions, so 60 questions total. And you can retake it as many times as you want to. I failed one part, but I passed the second and third part, and you don't have to retake the whole test. That's the cool thing. You only have to take that one part that you failed. So if you fail, like we had one dude, he failed one part one day, came back the second day, took the second part, and still failed the third part, and then took came back fell, and then took the third part. So I guess he was he's I guess he was finishing a part. Uh, Keontae passed all three parts. So, and we literally only took like literally everybody in the class only took three days to study, or you can go out of your way and get it on your own time, which I would do because the first week you just sit in class and learn how to actually pass for the permit test. But the people that already passed they literally were just sitting there on their phones all day because they didn't have to actually worry about the permit but you can i can literally give you a quizlet that will guarantee you you'll pass with like i think i'll have like 120 questions memorize all of them and you will definitely pass and then you also got like the um next the second week it's called pre-trip and basically the only thing you do is go around the truck and you name the parts uh it took me, Keontae, and everybody in the class, like, I want to say, like, four days. But they'll literally give you a, a piece of paper and go through a, over, literally every single day for a whole week. That's literally all you do. It's kind of really boring. So that's what all you do for the second week is go over the pre-trip. But they'll make sure you have a master down. Uh, Thompson, I think he already – I made a video – on YouTube, so he already he was looked at that and memorized the pre trip before he went, and I think he said it only took him a couple of days. Me and Keontae only took us two days, and we literally I don't know anything about trucks at all at the time. Like I don't know anything about cars, so I was completely terrified of it, and I got it down pretty quick, like in a couple of days. So it's nothing crazy. The next thing you got is your uh, actual driving driving. So the third week, literally all you do is drive for like six hours a day for the for every day, five days a week. Um, it's pretty easy. You just drive around. You literally have somebody in there with you. They're going to basically babysit and explain every way to drive. They're gonna be they're going to make it seem like it's they're gonna be harder on you to drive than it actually is. When you take the test, like, the test is going to be super easy. Like, it's going to be extremely easy. The hardest thing is probably the pre-trip, and that's easy. And out of, for a TDI, I know out of, like, they told me out of 200 people that came that year, only one person failed. So you really, really got to have a, be terrible to fail. But, yeah, um, I was I was really bad at driving, and I still pass. Like, I drove the... I think I like when I was doing the practice driving, I, like almost like hit something, and you know, there's one dude he ran a whole tractor into a ditch, and he passed his first time. We actually took the real test, so stuff happens when you practice, and they understand that, and they also understand that none of us have experience or we're terrified, so they you know they're gonna work with you.